Hi Aquarius, how are you? This is your general love reading. The current energies, the energies in the near future, the person on your mind as well. I will be looking at all those and other details. If you are new here, welcome. I invite you to subscribe because I post videos every day. Keep in mind that this reading may or may not resonate with all of you. If it does resonate, I will do an extended reading at the end of this video. You can find it in the description box below if you are interested. Okay, let's start with the energies around you. There's a strong chemistry here with somebody, but somebody is acting very cold, like they don't care. But the chemistry is there. It is a very intense relationship. Now I think somebody might need to make a decision. I have Gemini here. Air signs, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. Yes, this connection makes you both happy, in fact. But why is this King of Swords? Somebody is acting cold because it was dramatic. Uh, it feels heavy many, many times, like a big burden. Okay, this is a special chemistry, but apparently this can't last a long time because of the dramas. There's something that is not working there, and that seems the biggest blockage. But what is affecting you in your subconscious? that you might not be aware of. You still have attraction here. You still think about them. Sometimes you think, are they honest or are they a manipulator? What was the main challenge in the past? A, a lack of stability or somebody just focusing on their work, their career or oneself? Not showing uh, much maturity or there were differences in maturity level between you and them. Your focus is a peaceful conversation. Some of you might want reconciliation, but you want to avoid conflicts, unnecessary disagreements. Now let's see about hopes and fears. Your fear is that this might still be toxic or some toxic patterns might be repeated and again and again if you give this another chance. You know it is a strong attraction there, but toxicity is present there as well. That's what you fear. Now, before jumping, what are their thoughts and energies towards you? Let's see about what are the energies in the near future. Avoidance. A sneaky behavior. A rapid communication. This is quite interesting. If you are wondering if somebody has learned their lessons, I don't think so. Or if they do if they do regret anything, it is mixed feelings here. Uh, one day they regret it, one day they don't. Uh, but they feel low. This person might want to talk and communicate with you. When they feel low, they want to talk. But it's very difficult for them to accept any uh, lies or them not being quite honest with you in many many times in that connection i think expect communication to happen but i don't believe this person might have changed much if this is a past person now if you're interested interested into a new connection let's see what are the energies about new do we have something new not yet it might be a bit postponed it seems quite passionate intensive as a new relationship if you're interested for that but uh, it might not be for the time frame of this reading. Now let's continue with the person that is on your mind. Let's see about them, their energies.
one last shuffle. So what are the overall energies for this person? They want to return. I think they want to. They want to come back. They want to tell you that they have learned the lessons. So as we recently saw in the near future, I don't think they completely have learned the lesson, but they want to tell you that they have changed for the better and they understood the blind spots in the connection with you. They want to make this successful. They want to be with you in a serious commitment. That's what they want to tell you. In fact, they are a bit indecisive, but I don't think they will be showing you that. If it was them dealing with another person, like a third party situation in the past, I think they still have that option or another option. Not quite focus into one relationship, especially if they lied or were a manipulator. Let's see more. Why the two of pentacles? Okay, another if not, if that is not the case, I think uh, their hesitation and indecision might be from the fact that they are not completely sure if this is over completely and it cannot be restarted. They're not sure if there's a chance, a second or another chance to restart this. They seem a bit more mature. They... They really might have changed a little bit. They're trying to focus at their business, their career. They have lots of resistance. I think they would like to come back, but it needs lots of motivation and energy from their side to do that. They still believe it is heavy. They want something completely new and fresh. That's why they have been watching you. They have a big ego. But the connection, attraction is very, very strong. It is very special between you both. Okay, this was the general reading. I hope this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Please hit the like button if this reading resonated with you. Or if you liked the video. I will see you the next reading. Bye for now.